Okay. Uh, I did ask you guys for some suggestions on how to cut my um, my pen tube lengths um, consistently and and cleanly. And uh, after listening to a few of you guys, I, I think I came up with something that's going to work uh, temporarily for me. Um, I did post that link on the Harbor Freight Chop Saws, the small six-inch one, and I think the two two-inch one. I think I'm going to go with the six-inch little chop saw that'll. It'll cut my pen tubes, and it'll also uh, do some other things around the shop, such as conduit and stuff like that. But anyway, I wanted to show you this idea. Um, I think it works pretty good. And uh, the only issue I'm going to have, or I do have right now, is the uh, um, the teeth are pretty aggressive on my bandsaw right now that I'm using. Um, but it still cuts pretty clean. Anyway, um, what I do is I made a, I got a chunk of maple, and... Uh, the tubes that I was cutting were for the bolt action, and uh, that's a 3 8 hole that I drilled in there. And then I uh, I measured from here to here, which is the length of my tube, it's about 2 inches. And uh, I put a stop block over here, so I just butt this thing right up against it, and it lines up to um, the 2 inch mark on the bandsaw. And uh, like I said, when the tube, I stick the tube in the hole, and uh, I run it through the chop saw and it gives me a pretty clean um, edge on the tube and uh, it gives me consistently uh, the length of the tube that I that I need in here and again that's just a stop block for the tube to bump up uh, bump up against in there and uh, so I just set it in I run it through cut it I jam that other one out with this and I just keep going and uh, it seems to work pretty good I hope you like the idea maybe you can add on to it or Modify it any way you want. Talk to you later.